July 14th, 2015, uh, coming to you from the sweltering heat of the Mojave, they call Kansas City, about 115 degree heat index today. So we're going to stay inside and we're going to do a little tackle warehouse unboxing. This will be uh, a much scaled down, uh, non-professional version that you've seen posted on uh, YouTube by Tom Peterson, aka Cayuna. Uh, this is going to be pretty short, sweet, and simple. Um, I have my helper over here, Gracie, laying in a warm blanket right now. Uh, but let's get to it. Let's see what's in the box. Tackle Warehouse does an outstanding job of packing these boxes because it is valuable materials. Um, the receipt, quite a few items on this receipt this time. Look at that right there. That has Chatty written all over it. Free Tackle Warehouse t-shirt. All you gotta do is buy a bunch of stuff, you get yourself a free t-shirt. So Chatty will be wearing that. Okay, um, let's start over here. This is not necessarily for the Leech Lake trip, but this is something I've been wanting to get for the troll animal for my Minn Kota. This is called the Troll Perfect. It's basically just a stabilizing system that you put near the bearings and uh, and works well uh, when you're fishing in big wind and uh, helps put stability on the bearing at area of the uh, trolling motor so I thought I'd give that a shot. Next let's turn to uh, the most important thing between you and the fish and that is heavy braided line when you're fishing the heavy rice of Leech Lake. This is 65 pound Power Pro. Look at that baby. 1500 yards. And the reason we need 1500 yards is because you'll see right here um, my buddy just sent me six reels. Um, two of them are new over there. They need line. And notice how they come in these nice little uh, neoprene cases. Very nice, Tommy Pete. I will have to get some of those. Okay, uh, so getting right into it here. Uh, looks like we got some new baits that I've never tried. These are uh, bruiser baits called the Avenger. Seven count green pumpkin. We got, uh, looks like several bags of those. Maybe four or five bags of uh, green pumpkin. And it looks like we've got about another four or five, six bags of uh, Really one of my favorite colors on Leech Lake, and that is black and blue. So that's just a creature style bait, um, kind of like a beaver. Uh, that brings us to our next item. This is the Missile D-Bomb in super bug color. And again, this is another punching type bait that you work through the uh, wild rice with it in a, as in a Texas rig form. And uh, this, is, uh, this is another um, beaver style bait, except this one's ribbed. So very popular. Um, I've got a little experience with them, and uh, they're pretty good. Um, these next baits were purchased with uh, Tommy Pete in mind. This is the Gambler Cane Toad. This is a four-inch uh, topwater frog with big kicking paddle tails on it. Um, drives the big bass wild. I feel Tommy Pete could easily catch a six-pounder or better on this bait this year. Uh, but it looks like we've got... Uh, Cane toads in multiple colors. Looks like the color is uh, black, bullfrog. Looks like we got a bunch of uh, several bags of that. Um, I did stock up on these recently, so uh, there's more where that came from. Uh, the next item I'd like to show you is uh, the Omega Alpha Shad Buzz Bait. So this bait right here is 7 sixteenths of an ounce. It's actually kind of a tri blade. I'm not sure if you can see that right there. Uh, but it's got two interlocking blades that bang against each other, make a pile of noise. It's in my favorite fish catching color, which is gold blades and black body. Uh, it's the only color buzz bait that you need to throw. Um, and you can fish this bait extremely slow because of that blade combination. And uh, I feel like just buzzing that along some of those rice beds is going to be absolutely the bomb. And it looks like we got two of those. Again, never buy baits. In less than at least two per two per you absolutely have to have two uh, this item here is kind of for leech lake but just something that I've been uh, wanting to have on hand having the boat in case of an emergency you never know when you're gonna break a rope on your trolling motor um, without a trolling motor obviously you can't fish so we got a backup there always good to have a backup now this next item right here is something that uh, my buddy Tommy Pete turned me on to it's called mend it he claims that this works very well, gluing swim baits, worms, any plastic baits together in case you want to create some sort of a super bait uh, for fishing. 
Chatty might need one of those. And then we'll get down to the real money section of this box. And that is a lure called the Yamamoto Bat Aika. And this is all about Chatty right here. Looks like we've got about 10 packages of the uh, Green Pumpkin Purple Flake. I know that's Chatty's favorite color. So that's a hundred of those, bro. Hopefully you can, hopefully you can, uh, you know, make that do. And then it looks like we got about another, I don't know, five bags of uh, black and blue. Uh, we do have quite a good stock on all these baits in the basement. So I think there's 150 Ikas right there. There's probably, probably a thousand downstairs. So we'll have plenty of Ikas for you, bro. Um, but that's basically it for the unboxing. Um, I know that wasn't very exciting, but those are some, some key lures for us. I do want to take you over here. Um, we got some other work going on. We've got some rods set up. You can see there's a bunch of falcon carers there in the corner. Those are uh, Tommy Pete's rods that are, once I get his reel spooled up, they're going to go there. Over here, I'm working on uh, a few rods for this weekend. And there's a few more there in the corner that uh, probably gets get some use this weekend uh, as I'm fishing the Big Bass Bash on Grand Lakes. So uh, that's it for the unboxing. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Looking forward to the big extravaganza on Leech Lake at the end of August. Seeing you.